you can produce some amazing effects using Apple Motion. Check out this effect. To start, drag a movie file from the file browser into the canvas window. Then click on the text tool at the top of the toolbar. Go ahead and type your title within the canvas window. Next, click on the Select Transform tool to reposition and resize your title. Navigate over to the Utility window and click on the Inspector tab. Then click on the Style tab for the text object. To make things easy, go ahead and choose a Style Preset. Navigate to the toolbar and click on the Add Behavior button. Then choose Text Animation Sequence Text from the pull-down menu. This behavior will automatically select the first glyph within your text object. Now move over to the Behaviors tab within the Utility window. Change the sequencing to Custom. Click on the Record button within the Mini Timeline. Drag the first glyph so it's off-screen from the visible picture area. Then move the playhead indicator forward a couple of seconds within the mini timeline. Next, drag the glyph back to its original position. If you back up and drag through the timeline, you'll see that each character flies in one after another. Now turn off the red record button. Okay, you should see a red keyframe path within the canvas window. Right click in the middle of the path and choose Add Point from the contextual menu. Drag the new keyframe out from the original path to create a curve. You can adjust how many characters are moving at the same time by adjusting the spread parameter within the Behaviors tab. That's it! Check it out! For other great tips like this, or to enroll in an Apple Motion training class, visit GeniusDV.com.